before an experiment with animals starts, everything that will be done to the animals is written down in the work protocol. This protocol gets checked by the animal welfare body and the site where the animals are kept. The experiment may cause an animal to experience pain, stress, or discomfort. The official term, discomfort, covers all of these. The discomfort that is expected as a result of an experiment is written in the work protocol. Each animal is checked regularly by the caretaker, the animal technician, or the researcher. If you are the one doing this, then write down anything unusual in the welfare log. What should you do if you see signs of discomfort? Ask yourself the following questions. Are the clinical symptoms different from those described in the work protocol? Is the discomfort worse than what is described in the work protocol? Is it appearing earlier or later than described in the work protocol? Is it occurring in more animals than what is described in the work protocol? Is the discomfort unnecessary and therefore avoidable? If the answer to all these questions is no, then this level of discomfort is expected with this experiment. Write everything down in the welfare log and keep an eye on the animal. There is no need to report the situation to others. If you have answered yes to one or more questions, then the discomfort is unexpected and the animal needs extra attention. Mark the cage using, for example, a colour-coded label. If the situation is acute, ring the study director immediately. If neither the study director nor the alternate study director is reachable, then ring the designated veterinarian or the animal welfare body. In all cases of unexpected discomfort, whether acute or not, send an unexpected discomfort report to all involved. Send it at least to the designated veterinarian and the animal welfare body. Do this as quickly as possible, within four hours at the latest. Describe the clinical symptoms, the amount of discrepancy and the degree of discomfort. How to send the report differs for each facility. Use the animal registration system or email so there is a record of the correspondence. The study director determines what to do, possibly in consultation with the veterinarian or the animal welfare body, and then reports to those involved and records the communication. Carry out the instructions, then note that you have done so in the welfare log. Send a message through the animal registration system or by email as a follow-up. Once the unexpected discomfort is relieved, or if the animal has died, conclude your report. Send another message to all those involved. The animal's welfare must always be ensured. If you observe unexpected discomfort and cannot reach anyone responsible, keep acting responsibly yourself. This may mean that you will need to euthanise an animal to put it out of its misery. Don't forget to record and report everything. What if you unexpectedly find a dead animal? The work protocol will tell you what to do. Note everything unusual in the welfare log and report the unexpected death in writing to the study director, the designated veterinarian and the animal welfare body. The bottom line is, act responsibly, record and report.